Good morning guys, happy Saturday. Welcome back to another vlog. So I'm about to head off to the gym. As you guys saw, I had a bagel for breakfast and I'm really enjoying having bagels lately. I forgot how much I love them and the Dave's Killer Bread bagels are just so good. So I had that for breakfast and I have my gym outfit on and I'm about to head off to the gym. I think I'm gonna do a full body workout. And then I think today my mom and I are going to go and just kind of like look around for dorm shopping. I have to get a... um full size comforter because last year I had a twin size bed but this year I have a full size so I need to get like sheets and a comforter for that and obviously there's other things that I need to get but um you know everything's kind of weird right now we're not sure as of right now I am moving in August 13th so we're kind of just planning that that is what's going to happen but you know everything changes every day so you never really know my school gave the professors the option to change classes to online if that's what they felt more comfortable doing so one of my classes did end up doing that but I still have four that are in person but we're just going to kind of look around and see what we can find maybe not necessarily buy anything but just like I said just see what's out there and get some ideas of what I want my room to look like I am living on campus again, but I'm living in an apartment style, so there's going to be four of us, and I have my own room, my own bathroom, and then we'll be sharing a kitchen and a living area. There's a washer and dryer and all that, so it's going to be super fun, but I just thought that I'd bring you guys along the day. Hopefully, we can get some dorm shopping footage and just see what's going on with that. Alright guys, I'm in my driveway actually, but I just wanted to say that was such a good workout. I filmed it for you guys. Sorry that the clips and quality is kind of bad. It's just hard to get like good angles in there because I don't have anyone to film me. And there's just like people everywhere and I want to like, you know, keep my distance and not be in their way. But it was a super good workout, full body. If you guys want to try it out, do it. It was so good. I will have like written down in the description box the workout. I put it on the screen too, but I'll have it in the description box in case you want to like screenshot that or refer back to that. But I was really not thinking that I was going to have that good of a lift today. I don't know if it was the bagel that just gave me a ton of energy or if like, I don't know. I just, it was a really good workout. I think full body is definitely my favorite because I just like to hit everything and I just feel so energized and like, I don't know. That was just a really good workout. So I really liked that. It was super fun. And now I'm home. I'm very hungry and thirsty. My water is empty. So I'm going to go in and fill this up and make some lunch and probably a shower and I'm assuming sometime in the next like hour or so my mom and I and maybe Emma are gonna head out and I think we're gonna go to Kohl's that's where I got my comforter last year and I loved it and then also Bed Bath & Beyond and just kind of look around the main thing that we're looking for is a comforter but I know that there's like other things I need like sheets towels things like that but I don't know if we'll actually buy anything today but we're at least just gonna look around so yeah it's a really pretty day outside glad I got my workout in and I'm gonna head inside now I'm listening to Taylor Swift's album as usual what else is new I'm memorizing all the words and it's great so <laughs> I just got dressed. I'm wearing just a t-shirt and some Lulu shorts and I think we're about to head out in a few minutes. I kind of want to stop and get Starbucks. I don't know if that's going to happen. I um, 
and then ask my mom if that's okay i don't know if i want coffee though if i want to get a tea i've been really into the passion tango iced tea i get it unsweetened and last time i got it i got it with um sugar-free vanilla syrup in it which made it taste like really good because it was obviously sweeter and i also might add almond milk this time kind of like a healthier pink drink i don't know but we're about to head out it's like two o'clock so good on time and i'm excited to see what we can find i don't know if we'll find any luck with comforters last year it took me a while to find one that i liked so we'll have to see stop when you get a drink before heading to bed bath and beyond because you guys know i need it been a few hours since i talked to you guys we did end up getting a comforter we found it at kohl's um we also went to bed bath and beyond but we didn't find anything actually we did find one thing but we didn't find like a comforter there um i will show that to you guys later and talk to you guys about that later but we're about to make dinner right now i'm just making something for myself because we're all just kind of doing our own thing so i think i'm gonna we have some leftover ground turkey from tacos the other day so i think i'm gonna have this and make like a little burrito um, you guys know I love my spinach drops, so I think I'm gonna like heat one of these up on a skillet and then put some ground turkey and some vegetables or something in that and make like a mini burrito. And then we also have some leftover, like these are frozen peas and carrots, which guys, I literally never have eaten peas. Like I don't think I ever ate those growing up, but I just found these in the frozen, sec the frozen section one day and I was like, you know what? I don't really eat peas, so I tried them and you know, they're pretty good. So I've been enjoying having these from time to time. So I think I'll just heat these up too. And yeah, just something quick. It's already pretty much made for me, so it won't be taking very long. Hi guys, it's currently the next day, it's Sunday, and I haven't vlogged in a while, obviously, but I just kind of want to pick up the camera because I think I'm going to try and make an acai bowl. I've literally never had an acai bowl, like, ever, even at, like, a restaurant or something like that, but obviously I know you can make them at home, and so I bought these packets at uh, Target yesterday, just like little acai packets, and so I think I'm going to try and make one. I don't know if, like, my blender is going to be able to do this. We're going to have to see. I have a Ninja, but I also have like a legit blender because the Ninja is kind of small. So I think I might use this blender. I'm just going to take one of these packets and then I think I'm going to add, I don't know. I guess you have to add a little bit of frozen fruit. I have like mixed berries. So I think I'm going to add some of this and then I'll top it with like a bunch of fun stuff. So we're going to do this and see how it works. So this thing is like literally rock hard, but it says to slightly thaw it at room temperature, which I'm too impatient for that, or you can just put it in like warm water for a few minutes. So I'm heating this up and then I'm gonna just stick it in there while I get everything else ready and hopefully it'll thaw out a little bit because right now it's like rock hard. And then I'm just gonna cut it open after it soaks for a little bit. Okay, I also have frozen spinach and a little sliver of frozen zucchini that I think I'm just gonna add in there because you really can't go wrong. I think it'll help with the thickness of it too. And it's just obviously a good way to like add in veggies. So we're going to do that. And then I'm going to add in like probably half a cup of these berries. Okay guys, I got it blended up and now I'm getting my toppings. I put it in the freezer just so it could like 
freeze a little bit more because the consistency is pretty good but because i had that big zucchini in there that was kind of hard to blend but um i'm just gonna leave it in the freezer to like freeze more obviously and i'm just gonna get my toppings ready so i'm gonna put strawberries blueberries cut up some banana and then i bought cacao nibs i've literally never had these ever and then i'm gonna drizzle some peanut butter on top and maybe some granola Look what I just made. Oh, I say evil. So I told you guys that I would show you this yesterday, but I obviously forgot. So this is what my comforter looks like. And it is super cute. It's kind of hard to see. Well, you can kind of see it, but it's really soft. Um, I'm still going to keep looking around, you know, just like as we're shopping for other things. So if I find something I like better, we will return this. But we found it at Kohl's, and I wish you guys could just feel how soft it is. But it's just gray, and it is a um, full size. So I'm excited. It's super soft. But like I said, if I find something else, I will return this one. But as of right now, I really like this one. And I just kind of wanted like a neutral color so that I could just kind of play around with the pillow colors because i'm not really sure what vibe i'm going for yet and that way i can just kind of like decorate my room however i want because this is just like a nice neutral color so i'm gonna start looking for some pillows um and then also at bed bath and beyond we were just kind of looking around so it's this little like over the cabinet thing where you can just like put it in your bathroom and you know you can as you can see you can like hang a brush or a blow dryer and then just put some stuff in there so i just thought this would be like super handy and it was like five dollars so we just picked that up just like writing down things that we know that i'm gonna need we made like a better list but these are the two things that we got yesterday when we went out also while i'm here showing you guys stuff i went to lululemon today and I'm super excited because I got a sports bra. I found a pair of shorts that I really liked, but they didn't have the color I wanted in my size. So I didn't end up getting those. But I did get a sports bra, my first sports bra from Lululemon. I'm really just going off, honestly. So it's this really pretty, like, leopard print pattern. I'm sure you guys have seen this pattern before. I love this pattern. I wanted to get it in leggings, like, a long time ago, and I just never did. But this is the Free to Be, I think. Yeah, Free to Be... Free to be um, serene sports bra and I got a size four so I just love the back of it it's got like these crosses as you can see it's kind of hard to show this to you guys but because it's like such a dark color but it's super cute and I'm excited to wear this to work out and stuff I literally don't have like a good black sports bra so it's gonna be a really good like staple item to have so I'm super glad that I got them Hello guys, so I'm looking rough, but I just want to end off this vlog here because I realized I forgot to. I'm editing it right now, but I do hope you guys enjoyed it. I feel like it was a little bit all over the place. Um, this is just kind of my weekend, and I just kind of wanted to vlog some of it for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed what you did see. If you liked it, make sure that you thumbs it up, and don't forget to subscribe down below because as of right now, it is July 30th, and I move in august 13th and i'm so excited so make sure you guys are subscribed so you don't miss all the college content that is coming and more dorm shopping for sure and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys